Assassin's Creed Rebellion Swift Assassination event. I started to play this event yesterday and uh, if you remember I uh, came to the mission 5. However, today I was able to uh, promote one step more Magdalena from 3 stars to 4 stars. I get extra bonus and I decided uh, to level up them a little bit uh, to be ready uh, for this uh, like challenge 2. So basically this mission, mission 6. And uh, well, they are pretty successfully, let's say this way. So I, I upgraded Ma Magdalena to level 31 and Matteo to, to 31. However, I just simply ran out of the codex and I couldn't uh, upgrade Saeed more than 26. But uh, it's still enough, you see, uh, the, the requirements is uh, uh, 1270 minus 1271. Yeah, I will show you the gear. It took me like one day to uh, level up them uh, from 21 I, I have yesterday, I had yesterday to 31. So what's happened, so for Magdalena, I equip her 4, 4 and 2. Why 2? I have some uh, boots for the 4, but I gave these boots uh, to uh, Matteo because it's already enough for the power. I have only like uh, one boots rank 4, 4 stars. So Matteo uh, just uh, he's common so even at level 31 I need to completely dress him in all four so to met, re met the requirements. But these two guys they are rare so uh, more easy to equip. Man, you see tw level 26 but somehow he qualified. So I cannot use for him gear, uh, gear uh, four stars so I use three stars but <laughs> I just firstly like ah, 25, 24 it's still not enough, 25 not enough, later go to farm a little bit codex, okay 26, okay yeah now, now he is qualified. So let's go and finish this mission 6 and it's not really difficult of course. Um, what's happened another thing just because I have a better bonus and I go with the mission 6 so I have chances to uh, now I, I suddenly uh, not unexpectedly but uh, well just uh, kind of easily join the top 3 and uh, for this reason I decided to buy uh, I, I bought these rift tokens today to play more and now I have chance to go to uh, to like uh, fight for the top three. 72, 76. I don't know how hard I will fight for this uh, top three or top one. Let's see. Anyway, I have. Uh, oh! Unseen Blade. You, you have seen that I finish Unseen Blade. Uh, it's Animus Challenge. By the way, by the way. Yeah, so it's very good coincidence. Coincidence. Yeah, that's it. So probably I will, I can try to uh, compete for uh, like rank one or two. I need to heal up Matteo a little bit and I can rush again. Yeah, I get to 5 and 18, 23, like 20, 24k. 20, 4k, yeah. Okay. So basically, uh, for hundred, uh, for hundred, these rift tokens, I can uh, um, boost hundred k in the score in the progression. Okay, let's collect progression first, 
and the C the ranking. So now I'm standing rank 2, rank 3 not very far I go. Actually rank 1 is well also not so not so uh, anyway let's try i already bought uh, my rift tokens uh, for today i will probably buy tomorrow and see how the things will go maybe one day 20 so still have two days so i will be able to buy rift tokens twice i don't want to re re reload i can reload basically but uh, that's how it's going so basically i i uh, uh, do mission six with the better rewards so now like my rewards 125 125 so it's uh, like 250 350 yeah and the uh, the challenge six and the ranks start to go up but probably is also uh, my uh, competition in my uh, probably competition in my group also not so high also i joined a little bit late that well that's it ah i should collect i should collect animus challenge yay animus challenge it was actually easy to do there was uh for animus challenge what did i do um actually there is a loot 23 loot 23 if you do also assassinate loot 23 i can write we uh, run with three assassins aguila luciano and maria on the auto yeah by the way on the auto just five times it's a lot of 12 assassinations there yeah that was kind of easy and uh, basically loot 23 it's uh, the best mission uh, actually for the loot because it's uh, it's uh, loot 23 gives uh, different uh, for different items and useful all are useful have a nice game wish you good luck in this event